How's it going all? You're watching Patrick Plays, and today I'm finishing up the episode, The Signal. So just sit back and enjoy. Like, I feel like I can run for a while like this. But as soon as I start getting attacked... The earth shook! Ugh. Street light now pushed themselves up to the ground, flickering madly in big parts. Okay, this is just too weird. You're weird. Very. <laughs> is all this really coming out of my head? It's just the way this place is, Al. All that random stuff in your head. They help a lot. I do like the random lights, but... They could stay on a lot longer. I'm gonna die again. Gee, my Christmas. More? Like, do I just need to go? But Mr. Asthmatic here, he won't run when I need him to run, so I gotta wait for his stamina or whatever to regenerate. He's like, oh no, I'm in trouble. Let me just kind of leisurely walk around. Just want to get to that light. That's where I literally had to go. I was like two feet in front of the light and I died. <laughs> oh, okay. The God of Thunder. And Barry's got a lot of cutouts, man, that he keeps with him. Just making my own path again. Red box. I don't know if I like this. You need to get that door open before you can get into the warehouse. That's the way forward. Maybe I don't want to get into the warehouse. Why is it so complicated? Because you're a complicated man, and no one understands you. But I'm talking. Barry. The Billy Destruction Derby. Yeah, there, there's like literally nothing I could do right now. They got me in this corner. Shut up, Barry. Just standing up there on top of the, the logs, critiquing me. I don't like that. That one is going right to the great junkyard of the sky.
Yeah, that's right. What are you gonna do now? Well, I guess the light just broke. I don't believe this is safe. I have no idea just what happened. I don't know where I'm at. Turn around now. Hey, he's like, well, I'm out of this one. Half the stuff that I'm doing, I don't even know what I'm doing because I can't see it. <sighs> Pretty sure I picked up that pump. Yeah, I got the pump shotgun. Make sure I got it and all that confusion. rifle. I'm going to stick with the shotgun. Hopefully it doesn't just start giving me hunting rifle, hunting rifle ammo. Hey, what are you up to? I thought this was my side of the bed. <laughs> okay. Once again, I'm a little turned around, trying to remember where I'm supposed to go. Can I jump that? Or is it too late now? I really don't know where I'm going. <laughs> Maybe I can follow this around? Of course I can. He entered the trap, surrounded what? by enemies. I entered we what? the trap? To run. That's a trap. I'm so sick of you. Yeah. That's a lot of bellies. They've always got stuff to throw. Every single one of them's got a knife or some sharp object to throw.
That's a bigger flashlight that I keep kicking around. Uh, come on. Holding the B button. At this point, he's using a strobe light. <laughs> Maybe it's a motorbike that I can get on and ride, and I can just ride my self out of here. Get back! Get back, you chainsaw murdering coward! That still gets me. Absolutely weird. When people get tired, they get careless. saved Alice, but I wasn't even sure when that happened. Was it days ago? Weeks? Longer? I had no way of knowing. Probably just a couple minutes ago. Run off the edge. Oh, do I gotta go back and hit the button again? That looks crazy dangerous, Al. Slightly. dangerous and what's on the other side waiting for me.
Hey, lover. Come here. I've got something for you. No, no. I could only hope that Alice was all right. I didn't know what happened to her after she left the dark place. Zane? Is that you? My knees! Hey, hold that pose. That was a good one. Like this? Yeah, but smile a little more. No, that's too much. You want to look mysterious. Maybe a little tough. You know how people go for those dangerous bad boys. But I'm not dangerous. Oh, come on. You write about terrible things all the time. People want to think that you're intimately familiar with them. You kill Casey in this book. You need to look a little bit like a murderer. Oh, that's good. Do that again. You look handsome. <laughs> and dangerous. You know, better? I wasn't sure about the beard before, but I was wrong. It looks good on you. Okay, I think we're done. Great. I want to get out of this suit. Hey, things are looking up. <laughs> Guess danger is sexy. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> that was when I was still working. When I felt like a real writer instead of a fraud. It was a good memory. I wished I hadn't seen it. He makes jokes about as bad as I do. I back. Well, oh, oh, oh. can't get his aspirin. Whether I collect all of the alarm clocks or not, not that big a deal to me. Just getting them to sh stop ticking in my ear. <laughs> Zane, how do I get out of here? That's what you face. That's you, even as we speak. Darkness. Darkness coming! Swept him away. Lost. He knew. He knew! He couldn't hold on. He knew there was no way out. Oh. No! I'm right here, oh, Zane! Going wrong. That's not me, it's just... Wrong. I don't know, an echo, a hallucination, the dark presence. No, the dark presence is not responsible for this. You are making this happen. You're trapped in your own nightmares. You are fighting yourself. Wake didn't understand it. He would never make it. He would never wake up. He'd get swallowed up in the rising tide of darkness. It was coming. It was coming. Shut up! No! No! Alan must be. Swept away by the gathering insanity. Zane was gone! Wake could feel the pressure. Gnawing at his mind. The darkness wasn't so bad. It was in him. He felt it. He knew the voice spoke the truth. It was just too hard to think. He can't. Couldn't make sense of it. Couldn't. He wanted to go with the flow. Stop thinking and just let go. Just let go, Alan. Just let go of the TVs. I don't know what's happening. Killed the TV boss. <laughs> oh my. It's a used garage sale coming at me. <laughs> wasn't enough. <laughs> I tried to dodge. 
<laughs> I tried to dodge. <laughs> Yeah, it would have been. Well, I didn't mean to shoot it all the way back there. I'm gonna die again. Jeez. I'm just kind of hiding out here in the back corner because everything's coming at me. I don't know if they'll stop coming or not. I'm hoping that they do. stuff here. It felt pretty good, actually. <laughs> It's the big TV boss. This is ridiculous. <laughs> Careful, Alan. The TV's sneaking up on you. <laughs> It 
It's all in your head. You've been making it up. <laughs> Literally. Attack of the killer TVs. Come on. Your delusions. Your Trapped within his own hell, man. It's wow, <laughs> he is screwed, absolutely screwed. <laughs> awesome. All right, there is one more after this one. I think it's called The Writer. I will be doing that one. And I think that is the last of the expansions, I believe. So, yeah, that was the end of uh, Signal, which I enjoyed. It was pretty good. It was really weird. But, uh, yeah, um, I want to say if you guys liked watching this, leave a comment down below. Also, don't forget to like and subscribe. It does help us out. But, yeah, thanks for watching and take care.